What's going on, man? You gotta grab a shoe? What do you gotta do? j Bar just left to go doo-doo. Only one doo-doo at a time, please. It's a lot of doo-doo going on. There's a whole lot of doo-doo. A lot of doo-doo's going on right now. You gotta do it synchronize. Yeah, there he goes. All right. Early birds have been coming in like crazy lately. This Sorry. is literally the three days in a row we've been filming some early birds. Yesterday you told me yep. that nothing was coming in for a little while. And then a box of one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight shoes just came in today. You need to film some early birds. I can get us some early birds. I feel like okay? you're forgetting all the birds, man. The no, birds, you know, and they, we they, them, we got them. The birds flocked together today. They did. We have an eight piece going on. And like always, we're going to start from novice or just not as hype and make our way all the way up to the most hype shoe. And a lot of these shoes that we have right now, majority of them are TBA on release date, so no one knows when they're coming out. Yep. And the ones that we do know are coming out are coming out during the holidays. And I believe there's just one shoe that's coming out this month. So okay. hopefully by the time this video comes out, you'll have about three to four days to be able to prep, to know whether or not you wanna buy it. to <laughs> buy it or not. So we're gonna start first with yeah. the waterproof Gore-Tex. Sale, right? This is a sale, sale light bone. There's a bunch of different names. So you have the sale light bone right here. Um, there was no color actually for this one. Right. But that's what they're calling it. Do you think that this back suede is waterproof too? There's no way, right? This can't be waterproof. I'm assuming the, this okay. middle panel is Gore-Tex. I mean, here's my problem is you know this, I mean? when it gets wet, gets ruined. This when it gets, but what, what if it has it some ruined. kind of, what if it's some special material? We don't know. For those of y'all who don't know, Gore-Tex is famously known for waterproof. outdoor wear, waterproof backpacks, jackets. I mean, Supreme does everything Gore-Tex. Right. They do collabs with North Face all the time doing Gore-Tex. Palace and, does Gore-Tex. And they do like the Cordura yeah. bags and things like that. So they say it's waterproof. Of course, suede is not waterproof or Nubuck is not waterproof. But if you look closely, you can see that it is sewn all oh, the way, sewn closed okay. water, with the waterproof material all the way up to the corner piece of the lace. Cool. So from here all the way down, it's technically waterproof. And even the swoosh, you can see this is all Gore-Tex. I like Gore -Tex the material material. that they use. I like the material, I like the color. It does to me give comfort Vibes. It does. You know why? It's you're going off the tag. Is that what it is? The tag's giving you the comfort vibes. Okay. I feel like the colorway is giving me the comfort vibes. It could be too. too. I'll A tell you the color. My vibe. favorite part of the shoe is the sole. What is that exactly though? It's just. It's nothing. It just looks like you stepped in some uh, tar. Something. I like how it's clear though. Yeah. Super cool. Super nice. This is I interesting. Think, to me. I think look these how will high do well for us. Look how yeah. the tag is. The tag's way up there. Yeah. Which is not normal. Not normal Usually the tags are gonna be down on a actually sew-in tag, not sewn all the way around tag, yeah. just on one side. Second. Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay. Boom. And I don't know how these are gonna show up on the camera because these are actually a very, very faint pink. And even when these were offered to me, I was like, I don't want, I don't need photons, I already got them. So, like, why are you sending me this? So they look pink but they're called light violet. Right. So it's almost like a pinkish purple, yeah. like a light Easter purple Super. pink. Has a lot of gray in it though. It does have gray in it. It's the, mixed with gray. The sole's kind of grayish pink. Yeah. The top's more purple than pink. Two-tone, just like a lot of the other It's clean. dunks that we get in. The two-tone colorway dunk is the most classic. What do you think about these? I like them. I think they'll Super. do well. We always talk about this color blocking is money every time on I dunks, just don't right? know about it coming out during the holidays. Yeah. I feel like this is something that should come out, you know, spring, March, April, May, yeah. somewhere around there. But at the same time, if you think about it, last spring, they are pumping colors already For out sure. like this. For so sure. I don't know exactly the method to the madness, but apparently there's a science behind it. And whatever they're doing, I it's working, obviously right? works. So. All right, let's keep it going. Our next for the Dunkers, black and white. Comfort insole on this though. What? Comfort insole. So what is this? Is this, is this the first comfort dunk? Is that what they're doing? It does feel a little more. No. Little, this looks like a regular insole. This is not a comfort insole, it's a regular insole. What does this mean? I don't know. Maybe it's like ergonomic or something. There's no extra padding on this. Let me tell you something For though sure about this shoe. For sure, it's not any extra padding, but it says it. it. Says comfort insole, but let me tell you something. I cannot find out what the name is for this. There's no name for it. Okay. I would like to call it the reverse pandas because it's literally yeah. the swap of what the pandas were, except for the color blocking on the toe. It'd be black, black, 
but as far as just the two-tone colors, white and black, right. just like the pandas. And this will do really well, of yeah. course. Clean. Everybody loves all white shoes for the most part. It's and a clean no release dates, all TBA, so no idea when these are coming out. No idea what the name of these are. <laughs> you gonna get them? Uh, no, I'm not gonna get them. They're cool though. It's cool, but it's a little too plain for me. I really wish that I would have gone back and just grabbed some pandas. I know we have them at the store, but there's days where like, you I just, just want to beat up a black and white pair. Yeah, I just want to bang them all up. I want to do that. And then I have a black and white pair of pandas and then I say, nah, fuck it. And I just pull these out and I destroy them. I don't wear my classic Air Forces a lot. I never see you wear those. But today I wore my Air Forces with my fit and it just so happened that uh, Cap Culture yeah. gave me this hat and it landed this morning too and it happened to match with my jersey so I threw it on. So shout out to Cap Culture. Shout out to Cap Culture. Thank you very much for sending us all hats. Underscore Sick. Cap Culture. And if you look, there's some detail on this. I got the baby blue, some key points. The key points. Cooperstown. <laughs> okay. And then I got the World Series patch Hold on the on, side. What about the back? What about the back? It's Bit not on. a flat though. Yeah, it's, it's not a flat, not flat patch. Okay, and it's, not, it. it's not a, what's it called? Color block? Uh, or color match. Color match. Not color match, not a flat, so. <laughs> but Cap Culture I mean, saw I got, our I got Boston two videos. out of the four. He, Cap Culture saw our Boston video, and that's why and he that's why he gave us a little care package, because yep. he saw that we had an interest in the fitteds when we went to Sneaker Junkies and found one. Next is the, this one's this one's nice. We're still part of the Dunkers. I'm. I really like this one. This one comes out in the holidays. No actual date, it just says holidays. But the vintage theme behind it makes it good. Let me get one, come on. There it is. Midnight Navy, vintage theme, dunk low. No release date, but they said it's coming out in the holidays. This is sick. They kept the two tone, except for the bottom, they did the aged sole, which gave it that vintage theme look. Now, you know I love this shoe. I'm about to get some uh, Georgetown Dunks that dropped today, dropped off in a second, and I'm interested to see what they look like because I think this is gray, though, on the ones that dropped today. To me, this is a solid. It's your favorite if, of all the Dunks? Out of all the ones we've done today, yeah. if they keep remixing the Venture Soul into all these two-tone color Dunks, I think that will really turn some things up. Hear me out real quick. I feel like the Vintage Soul stuff started coming from when these guys started doing customs. Right. So like Revise Paris and all these other different people that were dropping these custom dunks, custom Jordans and stuff like that. They were all doing these vintage soles. Right. And even Chino, our, employee, say Chino. our employee Chino, he literally vintage soles and vintage laces. Every shoe he Every has. shoe he owns. So when he comes in, it literally looks old, yeah. but it looks cool and yeah. I like it. So I feel like they caught on Nike to that. would have their ear to the streets and they, yeah. started, they caught on to that kind of stuff and then they started kind of doing it themselves. For sure. Which is smart, because no, I like it a lot. It's I, like, I like mixing the cream and the whites. So this is definitely a solid. Going number three. Got the box. Okay, so for those of y'all who have been keeping up, y'all probably know what this is right here if you're looking at this green. This also comes out in two weeks, October 30th. So by the time this video drops, you guys will be able to make the decision whether or not you want the shoe. Right, and I'm gonna read it off like I always do. We got Air Jordan 3 Retro, black, pine, green, silver, white. Okay, we'll just gave it away. Most of the colors don't ever give away know, what the shoe is. That's cool giveaway. It literally just said it. We have the pine green. Jordan 3. Jordan 3. I like this shoe. I like the shoe a lot. I like this shoe. Of course, everybody knows right off the top of the rip, Oregon vibes, of course, especially with the little goldish yellow trim around the logo. That one's gonna actually help set off to the Oregon vibes. Quality's pretty the nice on this. This, this yeah. new buck is nice. This new buck's sick. It's super nice. Color coordinations, the color blockings, I love it. I love the green, the black, and the grays. This goes very well. You've seen this with a lot of different shoes in the past. Right. So it's nothing really new. They just have it on the Jordan 3 this time. Six shoe. This is gonna be a GR. This comes out October 30th, and I expect us to get at least 150 pairs. <laughs> yeah, this shoe's gonna go crazy. This is something that we're gonna go heavy on. We got a size run early. Uh, they're not all here yet though. This looks like just one box landed. And of course though, on pawn release day, we'll definitely bulk up on these yep. for sure. This is a cop. Cop? Yeah. Cop. I'll is cop this a cop it. for you? I'll cop it. This is definitely a cop. Shout out Larry, but I'll buy it. Next, you won't be able to guess it through the box. This is a Jordan 4. Yep. And it says black, multicolor, multicolor, in war and then I don't know the French part. What you got? You got the thunders. Thunders. Another one with buttery new book. Thunder fours. This is a re-retro from the classic Thunder fours that were black and yellow yep. in 06 and 012. Here we are in 2021, 
and they did it in a black and red this time. Yo, these are hard. And the quality of these, these is are hard. fire. Super, super fire. You know what I really like? The tag on the front. I'm a fan of the tag, tag because they the matched it light. on the tongue. It's yeah, not popping all crazy that. like you saw on the University 4s or any other uh, topes and things like that. It actually sits very well with it. Yeah. The color coordination, you can never go wrong with black and red. Yeah. Black and red, black and yellow, black and white, like those three color combinations to me always, do really, Every always time. do really, really well. Yeah. I don't know why they put a spin on it and not doing the actual re-retro again right. of the yellow and black. Cause we got the other, we got lightning. We got lightning. Maybe yeah. that might have been the reason why. Yeah. They dropped the lightning, so there was really no sense in dropping it again. Like, we're giving you one of them. <laughs> yeah, it's basically going to just be reversing it the same year. Yeah. So I think this is dope. There's a lot of hype behind this shoe. This, along with the three, are going to do really well all the way up into 2022. And this is also going to be a shoe that we're going to go super heavy you know on. You know what it looks sick, too? What's that? Look at the soul. All black. Has there been an all black four soul? I, I don't mean, know. The black cats, I'd imagine, were probably. Yeah, all black cats probably like that. But yeah. with the white hit, and then I just noticed this. Look at inside the air bubble, it's white. Did not notice that. Yeah, I just noticed it just wow, now. Wow, that's super White cool on too. the inside, which also corresponds with the white Jumpman red hit. Sick. This is the simplicity fire shoe. is what makes this yeah, fire. fire shoe. And I already know that we're going to have, it's going to be a classic in here. Yeah. And they gave us good netting. They gave us good netting. I was gonna say None that. None of that shattered I, backboard I, netting. I was gonna say that, but they don't really do that with the nah, fours. Nah. They don't really mix it up. They really don't do that with the fives. Yeah. So I don't know why they were even acting. I'm that holding. Way. I'm holding that against Jordan. Super dope. I'm getting those. I'm getting the threes. <laughs> yeah. I'm not getting any of the dunks, but I'm gonna get these two for sure. All right, ready? This we're switching. We're switching teams now. Yeah, we're switching teams. We're Team Nike right now. And we don't usually do early birds for. We're about to do stripes. Other team. Stripes over checks, real quick. Tree stripe. Tree. This and one's this one's different. This one's this one's different. They've done it before, but this time they're doing it again with a twist. And just give me the shoe real quick. Boom. Boom. Reflective. Reflective. Beluga. Now, I could be wrong, but I don't think I am. This is the first 350 retro ever. Ever. Just think for a minute. Hold on. Every other time, they didn't re-retro the Wave Runners when they dropped it. They didn't re-retro the breads when they dropped it. You know what I'm saying? Well, they didn't remix it, you mean. They just made it again. When the breads re-retroed the 11s, they tweaked a little different things, yeah. but they re-retroed it five years later. Okay, so what about this? If they drop an Oreo Yeezy right now, or a, like a core red stripe one, that is that a retro to you? A retro. I don't think so it's then. five years. In the comments, leave me a comment if you think I'm wrong, but I think this is the first 350 retro the twist to it yeah is it's reflective so let me get my phone out i still remember whenever i uh hit these i hit these at town east and i went and picked up the og ones that's when belugas are selling for like 750 dollars like a band i will say this scott what's up i've done the video already it's They're, just like it's barely. weak it's so it's like they have like but one little thread going through like each little section you can see it on the toe it's the, the toe is where you see it the most on the entire like look up here in the front lace look at the top lace inside the laces behind the laces can you can see it perfectly yeah oh i see it that yeah you yeah, see it on that turn stripes this is the first time since 2017 i believe it dropped i believe so 2017 so it's been four years yep since they've ever dropped this shoe I can't say that it was on any Yeezy uh, Yeezy Day releases. It was. It was. If it was, I remember it was like 20 pairs or something stupid like it that. It was. Yeah. It, it restocked. I want to say last Yeezy Day, and it was very, very limited. Like so. This time they're yeah. back, but they're back with a twist. Yep. And it's the reflective. And I have these from 2017. Still destroyed my minor. I actually used mine. Me and my brother climbed the Hollywood Mountain. Where in those? In the yeah. You know how you could take yeah. the little oh, trail yeah. all the way up to the I'm big a, flag on the edge where the there. little Hollywood sign yep. is. Yep. I wore mine, and then all this. That's what I was about to say. Mine, my toe, come, my all, big toe can come through the bottom. All of my this shoe. broke out, yeah. and it's the only pair of 350s I have that I just like beat to shit. You know what I did? I turned it into slippers. I bent the back oh in, my God, I hate and it's literally that. house slippers. I wore them as house slippers for like. A year. House slippers, child. I hate people that, that, Love it. that stand on the oh, back I did of that. the shoe. I did that, bro. I hate that. House slipper. Laces, sewing, stitching, color. Everything's the same. Everything's the same. Everything. Everything is the same. Still got the same sole, yeah. all that. There's hype behind this. There's going to be hype behind it. There's because the people who loved the shoe before that couldn't get it then, and now it's probably just outrageously too expensive right this now. This was the first 350 V2. This was the first 350 the first V2. So let's see what it's going for right now. What size is this one? Uh, That's a good question. Let's see. This is a size 10. Do we have any guesses? 
I would say like 950 bucks or more. Let me check those. Don't I just don't know if the hype has died down. Well, to where now it's that not they that. released the, the news, it could have dropped, like how it always works. Like, I feel like 750? It's money, it's up there. 1050 was the last sale. So there's hype. There's still hype. And this says it released in 2016. I was off by a couple months. Yeah. yeah. It was 9 2016. Okay. So yeah. 2016 this released. So there's hype still. If it's a thousand dollars, that means there's hype. And that's been five years and they re-retro win. Every five years or more. I mean no, Nike does. Yeah. Adidas doesn't, but I love this shoe. I don't if we hit retail, I'll grab one just, just to replace it. the other one or yeah. just to have both. And then never wear it, just stash it in the collection? No, I'll wear it. I've you always wanted it. to wear my other ones, but I had the orange somehow bleed it over and yeah. this lacing came undone. And then of course the bottom came apart, so. All right, well, here we are, the main event. Can we get a drum roll, please? This is the Supreme Team. Supreme Team by any means. By any means. Now, for those of you who don't know what by any means is from, it's a Malcolm X quote. By any means necessary. And you've seen Supreme over the years do Malcolm X tees, jackets, and things of that matter over the time. And so of course they slapped it on here with the NY logo for any. And the cool part about this is, is you're saying sup. Yeah, sup on the tag. But where's the Supreme team? Oh, here it is. Yeah, on the back. Coolest part is I like this little Supreme team hit. Yep. These come in two colors, a white and black and a navy in red, but I heard rumors. What you got rumors of? I heard rumors of a Brazil colorway. Oh, the third colorway, I see. Now, Supreme leaked a picture the other day, it was like a couple weeks ago, yeah. and it was a top shot of just right here. Hmm. Hmm. Same tag, hmm. same tag. Now, there is no official, like they didn't say this was a part of it yet. Yeah. In all the media, they say it's just these two colorways. Right. But. Literally, yeah, like, yeah, there's on. no way Pass around me. that. It's literally Pass the same. Me. Same insult, same, same tag, the tongue tag, the sub tag, all yeah. that. So it's gonna be in three colors. I don't know how exclusive the Brazil might be, or if that's just gonna be like a bonus or I friends think it, and family. I think it'll be all together. Or, it'll be back. I mean, think about it. They promoted the Chewy released earlier and never talked about the pink part. That's true. And then when they dropped, it was just the pink was sitting there. And I'm like, yeah, I was yeah. on the phone with you, and I'm like, yo, they got it in pink too? Yeah. Like, I didn't know that. Yep. So super cool, quality super crazy. I love all the hits, no love on the toe, and then what's your say? No love as well? Is that no love just because it's a play on like the New York, uh, I love New York tees? It might be you actually, it, you might it, be right. Yeah, it is yeah, an NYC, yeah, yeah. You know, by sure any, right. and then it's NY, you know, is I love different. how they did that, how they added yeah, NY for the New York, on there. You know? Supreme Team's still my favorite. So you got the little famous, world famous. Oh, yeah. World famous. And you also have it here on the little hang tag. Boom, world that's famous. legendary. Yeah. Legendary I mean, That comes with all tag. the dunks and stuff that yep. they do. Every single one has that. Insole is just gonna have the Supreme on there. Yep. I think yours is gonna be the front of it. Is yours it's SCP? Sup. Yep, I got yeah, Sup. So, Supreme. Really, it'd be like this. <laughs> Boom. Now, out of the three, white and black all day. Can I be honest though? What? I'm not really a fan. Of the shoe? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Okay. It just so. doesn't do it for me because it's just like, I'd rather get, I'd, come on. Like, you rocking the fucking classic stars, low top, or you rocking this? Which one are you picking? I will say, I mean, of course I'm picking that That's one, but saying. you will say like, I'm not, a, I'm not a fan of just like prints and shit all over the shoe. We're just not fans of high hard. dunks. I don't like highs, but right. I like the strawberry cough. Because there was a cool, get. but that's a crazy theme. Yeah, for sure, for sure. That's a crazy theme to the shoe. I'd still rock the white and black ones. I like them. If you had to pick between the three, what would you pick? White, black. White and black. White, black. Cool. Just because it goes with everything. Now, the hype behind this is real. There's no release date to this as well. They just said holidays. So be looking for it in November, December. Holidays could be anything from Thanksgiving up to Christmas. So, you know, anytime. If, they're, if they're leaking stuff, like little snippets When they like say that, holidays though, that's never Halloween, right? It's always like November, yeah, December. Ho around. holidays start at Thanksgiving? That's what I feel like, right? I personally yeah. feel like holidays start, because that's when the family comes together. For sure. You know, family doesn't come family together time. for Halloween, I don't think at least. Family time. So. Definitely some dope pieces in here. Yep. Again, you know how like we, we like to go over our order. Right. So let's put these shoes up here and I'm gonna pick my order and you're gonna pick your order. Well, I see what you're gonna end with. I already know this. I think I'm like, oh, the early birds are on the floor. I'm trying to do it all on one arm. Like <laughs> Michael just up. told you you couldn't. All right. I think I'm stuck. All right. Psych. Now I'm done. I'm not a big fan with 
all this crazy Gore-Tex on. Because it looks like a comfort. I like the concept, but it seems too bulky and just not my style. Yeah. I'd put this one towards the end because it's not much of my color scheme. I do have the orange pearl, which is like that pinkish white. Right. But I do have a lot of pink because our own brand, Please Come Home, we've yeah, dropped yeah. a lot of things that match with it. For sure. This reminds me of just like a regular Air Force. I feel like if I wear this, I'm going to bang it up and it's just going to be very noticeable. Mm -hmm. Just like as you've seen, I've yeah. worn these twice now and they're already wavy. I feel like that's going to happen with Good. this shoe. Color, color always helps cover up the wavy. You got Sorority Girl Air Force Ones on right now? Yeah. <laughs> I don't wear navy yeah. and I don't like these colors and I'm, I'm not a fan of all the blocking around it. I like the concept behind it. And I yeah. like what the words say, the meanings the behind meaning. each words, but how it's put together, this isn't my, this isn't part of something that I'd put in my closet. Sure. This is OG to me. This is what one of the first, I guess it wasn't because I had some of the early releases of the 350s, but this was definitely my first V2 that I got. Right. It was the first V2. Right. To me, it's iconic. I like it. I own it already. I would like to replace it. Three is one of my favorite Jordans, so I'm going with this one. The hand craftsman to it, as far as the quality, is nice. It's got enough white in it. It's got a lot of black, but it has enough yeah. white to where I can put this into a lot of shit. Yeah, you can. I wear a lot of green. Man, again, I don't wear navy, but this off-white vintage theme, for some reason, bro, this is this Sick. is really, it's just cool to me. I like it a lot, and I have a bunch of dope reference hats that have this uh, so cream mark that it. I could rock it in different ways, and then. This is just my favorite. Fours is another one. Ones, threes, and fours, and elevens are my are my top ones. And just something about that little bit of white, just for me, makes it pop out. I'm not a big fan of wearing all black, right? But black and red is definitely a color that I like together. So this okay. is really weird to me, though. This order is weird when you actually put it together. One thousand percent. Okay, so mine is actually it's kind of similar to yours, Scott. Like uh, on key pieces, you know what I mean? Like we have the thunder in the same place we have pine green in the same place we have beluga in the same place we have uh black and white in the same it was place. just these two yeah those two are switched yeah so but you don't like height so i don't understand why it's up there because i'm a height beast bro you shouldn't be i know you should I'm, be at everything i'm beast. a height beast bro like i put a oh, i put a fucking gr dunk on the front i know i just need to stun on some people sometimes though for sure i mean if those were white and black they would be at the very I, front. I know i know i know okay um but yeah i mean the dunks, black and white. You know what? No, you messed this up. Look, it was like that. He messed this up. He switched mine over. This was supposed to be right here. Looking? This was supposed to be right here. This is dope to me. I like the colorway. The vintage style on this is sick too. I really like that. I could see myself rocking this a lot. This is just OG, but I would never wear it in today's climate of the world and sneaker world. But it's weird because you like comfortable shoes. And I do. Super comfortable. I do. And just boost is what got me back into sneakers after I got out of sneakers. Right, so for sure. I have a love for boost, but Adidas just isn't something that I normally wear anymore. Next would be pine you're, green. You're a dunker. I am a dunker. I'm a, I'm a dunker. For sure a dunker. Pine green three, Supreme, and then classic banger right now, man. This colorway is just sick. Tag, everything, white hits. Dope. All right, That's like we rep. always ask, actually, let's switch things up. I want the people in the comments to tell me, are you going with Ian's picks? Okay. Or are you going with my picks? That's what I want to know in the comments. You rocking with me or this guy? Are you rocking with the chef? You rocking with the chef? Is this your lineup? Or are you rocking with oh, this bro. chump right oh, here, man? I didn't get him get, over there, I didn't bro. get drunk like that. Yeah, you did. I just I said okay. this guy. Yeah, You're bro. one of those. You play Don't mean. Me, bro. You play mean. Hey, I play mean. I play, I play for keeps. That concludes everything. Thunder's my favorite. Yep. Let me know who you choose Look. with. And of course, just let me know which one you like the best, guys, please. And we out.